Hi guys, this is going to be a vlog. I'm going to title it something about dyeing my hair, getting my hair lighter, something like that. But this is a whole vlog, so if you're here for the hair, I'll just put a fucking timestamp so you don't have to waste your time. But if you want to see the whole vlog, hello. Today, I got ready to make a video and I really didn't have a plan on what I was going to record. So I was like, let me just vlog for the vlog tomorrow because tomorrow I have a hair appointment and I want to do something with my hair. I have I haven't dyed my hair in years. Like I've literally had, this is my natural color. I've had this since, I don't know, high school. Like I have not dyed my hair and I'm so freaking bored. So I really want to get it lighter. I don't know exactly what I'm going to do, but I want kind of like a light brown, blondish look. Not like straight up blonde, but just something lighter. So that's what we're going to be doing. But I wanted to vlog because I haven't done a vlog in a really long time and I miss doing them because we would all just vibe with the vlogs. I would post them every Sunday and it was just so iconic. So I'm just gonna be like recording what I'm doing today. My apartment is an absolute mess. I have to clean it. So maybe we can just chat as I clean it. Dolce is here. So everyone say hi to the true star of this channel. You look like a freaking sewer rat, Dolce. <laughs> <laughs> like this is not flattering. This is so much chaos right here. I'm actually embarrassed. So I need to do the dishes. I have realized from moving into this apartment, I am terrible at being an adult. And I hate when people say like, oh my God, I'm adulting. Like I hate that saying, but I'm really bad at being an adult. I'm very, not lazy, but I hate routine. So even just the little things of like doing the dishes every night just really make me feel like a sim. So I don't do that. <laughs> So they just sit there until I have a freaking mental breakdown and I do it all and then I feel cleansed. Let's do a little look around. So here's Dolce. As you can see, first of all, I got fall candles the other day and I'm thriving. So we got pumpkin, marshmallow. Down here we got a new leaves candle. So I have a cute little collection going on of crystals. These are some tester crystals for the fall launch that's next month actually. I got this new fluorite point. So fluorite was the last crystal that I really least on Camarda Crystal, so I got a little point to commemorate that. And then I have an even smaller one of Amazonite, which I did for the spring launch, so it's really cute to have here, kind of as like a memory. But anyway, that's it. Over here we've got more candles, so <laughs> we've got a vanilla chai. I got pumpkin clove. This is actually new at Bath & Body Works, I think. This is one of the best candles ever, pumpkin-wise. They have one called Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin, or something. I never fucked with that candle. I know it's like a classic at Bath and Body Works. It has never been for me. That one to me just smelled like fake Michaels, like fake cinnamon smell. This clove bud is it, sister. Over here we have pumpkin apple, which is one of my favorites. And then I've already had this, but this is vanilla bean. So we have just a cute little candle thing going on, right, Dolcelina? By the way, <laughs> my desk is missing because I moved it into the bedroom just because my fridge was causing in chaos. It was being so loud, so I wanted to escape it. This whole quarantine thing in this year has been driving me insane. I have no routine at all. I literally just do what I want all the time, which is kind of good, but also bad because I have built-in beliefs that I have to like do a certain thing every day and like be productive and blah, blah, blah. You don't just do what you want. Like we are out of control at this point. So just do what makes you happy. That's my message. Anyway, I'm going to clean. Let me show you guys my bedroom. So I don't know if I've shown my apartment much since the apartment tour. As you can see, <laughs> this is so like trash. I have my desk here and I was playing The Sims and it was so nice. I also have been really into Second Life, so I actually really, really want to stream very soon. I say this all the time and I'm sure it's extremely annoying because I haven't done it yet, but I really will be streaming like this month. I swear I will. I already set up my channel and now I'm just kind of learning like how to do it because that's the part that's really getting me and that's the main point you have to know how to do it to do it so I'm kind of learning like how to get my setup and everything so yeah what other updates so I've been tracking my eating because I've been eating everything in freaking sight and I feel good I think I have definitely like gotten a little skinnier not that I need to be skinny but I just was not content with the way I looked anymore I was like girl get it together I could just tell I was more tired I had no motivation so tracking my food has been really nice to help me kind of like force me to get um, everything in order a little bit more. So that 
that's good but i miss the gym and all the gyms are closed sadly i used to post videos like this all the time which side note i've posted so many apple videos lately that even i'm getting sick of it like i swear i did like five in a row i just want to vlog i want to play the sims like i want to do something different so i hope you guys are like, liking the vlog but if not why are you still here? I'll be back. <laughs> the next day. Hi guys, so I need to go in. I have like five minutes until my appointment starts, but I wanted to do a before. So this is my hair. It is all my natural like dark brown hair. It is like, honestly, it's still short, but it's starting to get to like that shoulder length where it's not like a bob. So it's starting to grow out a little and I like it. I'm just so bored with my hair and I'm ready for something new. I've had this hair for a very long time and I can have brown hair whenever the hell I want like literally if I hate this I could go dye it brown again and act like nothing happened so I'm just ready to do something new I really want like a light balayage kind of thing and I really need my hair to look like it has more volume because I just have like baby hair we've been through this so I'm very excited and I think it's gonna look really good I want something like not too warm but definitely not like gray though I kind of want it like just like a cooler tone that is still flattering for me so we'll just see how it looks I'm very excited so I'll try to vlog inside but if not I will do a result after so I'll see you guys later this is my last time having this hair peace guys <laughs> i got new hair and i look so freaking iconic i don't care what anybody says look how freaking good this looks like are you actually joking i am literally blonde like okay i didn't expect it to get that light because i know i have super dark hair but it got super light and it looks awesome like i feel like a new bitch like you know when you get your hair really different or just a big change and you don't know what to do like you need a minute for it to like set in that's how i feel i feel like so different <laughs> because I was just so used to having the same hair but I literally love this the color I didn't want anything super orange or brassy I didn't want like ombre 2015 vibes I really wanted a clean hair color that was like very modern and flattering I just feel like so brand new I literally had the same hair for so long I actually feel like I'm blonde I know it's like kind of a mix of the different hair colors like obviously I still have some of my natural brown but but the mix is just luscious like it looks so good and I am shocked I didn't really know what to expect I was kind of just like go light in my hair like I showed a few pictures and it looks lovely I can't stop looking at it and my hair feels so fresh like it doesn't feel damaged at all it feels like my normal hair so that's really good I think my hair was just very healthy and was able to do this so it looks awesome and I love it I feel rejuvenated I can't wait to stunt on everyone with my new hairstyles imagine this in a fucking space bun like with the little like blonde pieces sticking out goodbye this is amazing i'll probably vlog more later but i wanted to do like a quick thing showing my hair so there it is peace <laughs> but stop saying peace okay Jay, why do you do this every time i'm about to make a video okay so here is the final hair i know i did a little like thing in the car but i wanted to do an actual like reveal like at the <laughs> I wanted to do a reveal at the very end just to like really show it off so here's what it looks like and I really like it I think it's so good with my skin tone and I love how she got it like kind of ashy but not like silver where it doesn't look good on my skin tone it's a very nice just cool tone like beige I don't know I really like it she said I could go back in to do like another session if I want the ends to be more like solid blonde which I may do but I'm gonna let this kind of like I'm gonna let this kind of like soak in obviously like I need a minute to get used to it Everyone's like, oh my god. Do you like it? Are you sure you like it? I'm like, yes, I like it I'm just so like shocked that it's almost like I mean I've never had hair lighter than you know It's like back then where people would do like the ombre and it was like orange. That's what I've had That's the most blonde I've ever been so to see this is like crazy and to some people it may be like Oh, that's not really that much of a change like you're still brunette. I do think I'm brunette like I think I'm more on the 
brunette side, but I've never been this blonde. You know what I mean? So I really like it. And if you want something similar, I just told her I wanted like an all over, like lighter look with nothing too warm. Um, I didn't even say I wanted a balayage, but I'm pretty sure that's what it is. It's just like an all over like PC look, but it's not like chunky. I was really scared of getting a chunky, you know, those stripey highlights. I really did not want that, especially knowing how dark my hair is. I was afraid that it would look too separated, but I really like the way it looks and everything is very seamless and I'm very excited about it. I love the way it looks like watch this. <laughs> okay. So this is like stupid, but look how it looks in a ponytail. It looks so ashy and just light. It looks sick. I absolutely love it. And that's pretty much that on that. So hopefully you guys like it too, because I'm going to have this for a while, if not even lighter, but I really like it. I feel like a freaking latte. So I can't wait to be drinking my pumpkin cold brew looking like a bad bitch. So thank you guys for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it. My hair's like going crazy. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for watching. And if you have any questions, let me know. Dolce is saying bye. So that's it on that. Bye. I just want to keep looking at it. <laughs> I'm so annoying. Bye.